All right. Today, let us look at how we can add serial numbers in Excel automatically. Now, usually we would add serial numbers as 1, 2, 3, 4 and so on. Or we can also just select these and drag these down as much as we want. Now, these will work when we have only very few serial numbers to add. For example, here I had only 27. What if I had to add like 100 serial numbers or 1000 serial numbers and I want that to be added automatically. So for that, we can use VBA. Now, let me clear these things. And for opening the VBA editor, we can go to developer tab and click on Visual Basics. Alternatively, you can also click on Alt plus F11 to open the Visual Basics editor. Alt plus F11. Now, this is the Visual Basics editor and let me double click on this workbook. Now, I have got the editor window. Let me set it up so that we can see Excel and editor in the same screen. Yes, as you can see, I have the Visual Basics editor here and my Excel sheet here. Now, let us start by opening the subroutine. Sub and here I will give the name as add serial number. Let me click enter and it has created the end sub for me. Inside this place, we can write the code. Now, I want to activate this cell that is A1 first so that my code will start running from that point. For that, let us declare that position. This workbook dot active sheet. Instead of active sheet, if you have multiple sheets here and you want to declare that particular sheet, we can also declare the sheet by its name. Let me do that way now. This workbook sheets in bracket as a string let me write the name of the sheet here it is sheet one dot range in bracket let's say a one dot activate now we have activated the a one range click enter now we have to add serial numbers from 1 to 100 or 1 to 1000. Let us start a for loop. For i is equal to 1 to 100 or 1000 or how many ever serial numbers you want. Enter. <coughs> Active cell. Now, our active cell is A1 because we, before the for loop, we have activated the A1 range. Active cell dot value is equal to i. So, i will be 1 in first case. Next cell, it will be 2. Next cell, it will be 3, 4, 5 and so on. But here the problem is that active cell is always A1. We want the active cell to be the next cell after A1. So, we can create A2 as the next active cell. For that, active cell dot offset in bracket, the row offset is 1. That is, we want it to go 1 row below, comma, 0. We do not want to change the column number at all so it will be zero bracket close comma activate now what happens here is that after the code has given the active cell that is a1 the value 1 it will select a2 as the active cell now let us close the for loop by saying next i and that's it the code is done so let's look at what the code does. The code first makes A1 as the active cell here. After that, we have for i, let's make it smaller to i. Yeah. 
for i is equal to 1 to 1000 actor cell value is equal to 1 sorry i so a1 cell value will be i and after it has assigned the value 1 to a1 the actor cell will be a2 so next loop it will be i is equal to 2 so a2 is equal to 2 now let us quickly run this program and see if it works run and as you can see the serial numbers have been added till 1000 i hope everybody understood how we can add serial numbers to excel using vba